risk or reward, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Jacked up and good to go. The entertainment title in the following video is rated M for Mature. You have been duly warned. This video is not for children or the faint of heart. Welcome back, everyone, to me, Mr. Fulcrum, going through Bioshock Infinite. I don't trust Fitzroyd on our deal. Rich, poor, a Welsher's a Welsher. Ah. If you're ever in Canada, Baron Beaver Orange Creamsicle Soda made with cane sugar and real orange extract. I'm not sponsored, it's literally what I'm drinking, and it's the best cream soda you can have. <clears throat> Sorry! I'm playing in a bit. Hold on. I know I. Bigger menu. Okay. <laughs> six, six, six. All right. Found some money. Here you go. Thanks, kiddo. Alright, let's roll. Turns out the girl's no fool, and I'd not prefer not to fall on the wrong side of a temp. <laughs> Excuse me. That's some good old fashioned craft soda. I saw lockpicks. <clears throat> I don't have a feeling. Hello. Locked. Elizabeth. No problem. All What's done. In here? Okay. Mm. I'll take the gear, but I won't use it. I just realized I am going the wrong way. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. The truth is, 
as I don't have a lot of time for all that prophecy nonsense. I tell you, belief is, is just a commodity. And old Comstock, well, he does produce, but like any tradesman, he's obliged to barter his product for the earthly ores. You see, one does not raise a barn on song alone. Oh, no, sir. Well, that's fink timber, a fink hammer, and fink's hand to swing it. <laughs> he needs me, lest he soil his own. No jobs today, okay. <coughs> Elizabeth? If you wouldn't mind, kiddo. There. Over there. A service elevator. And get ourselves killed in the bargain. I don't have anything! We are no. Hey, get up! Perfect timing. That's all I have. Well, uh, there we go. Not time, Kato. Get clonked. Stole that dude's lunch. Oof. Hello. Ah. Smith Chen Lin wanted for known connections to the outlaw Daisy Fitzroy. Looks like our guy's drawn attention. That's not good, is it? No, it is not. Okay, I'm dumped. Load this bad boy. Let's see what else we got. Ah! Ow! Yeah, of course. Of course, you can scratch right there. I saw a hand cannon. Okay. There's another one. Back up we go. This seems right up your alley. It's done. Okay. <coughs> so remember correctly, there's a lock around here. There we are. Can you open this? Really? That little old lock. Done. Excellent. Let's see what's in here. Ooh. It's more health. <coughs> there we go. Full health. Better already. I'm gonna find.
find a hand cannon, man. <coughs> Game keeps teasing a hand cannon. I haven't seen a bloody hand cannon. Mother's diary. Why would Slate have it? My husband claims the child was created from whole cloth by divine will. I am a believer, but I am not a fool. His <coughs> bastard shall not be raised under this roof. My mother. She had me locked in that tower. Elizabeth. I just want to get out of this city. Please. Find me a hand cannon. <coughs> Find me a hand cannon. I'll put a hole through anything you want, kiddo. Greetings. My name is Jeremiah Fick, and I want to share with you my personal creed. <coughs> what is the most admirable creature on God's green earth? Why, it's the bee! Have you ever seen a bee on vacation? Have you ever seen a bee take a sick day? Well, my friends, the answer is no. So I say, be the bee! Be the bee! Hi. Uh, hello? Mr. DeWitt? Uh, Yes. Hold for Mr. Fink, please. What's going on? DeWitt, Fink here. Listen, my boy, we've had our eye on you, and I can tell you right now that you are our top candidate. Top! <laughs> now, uh, my associate, Mr. Flambeau, will help you with anything you need. <laughs> Mr. Who? What the hell was that? I have no idea. He seems oddly pleased to make your acquaintance. When did your shirt rip? Elizabeth? Well, the man's got an ego. <clears throat> the other arm's just fine. <coughs> also, I'm not ashamed to admit I did commit, um... want with us excuse me miss but mr fink's interest is strictly in the gentleman but why so sorry young miss but any questions regarding the gentleman's application should be taken up with mr fink directly does this strike you as good news does no it, it does not kiddo 
What do you think? Head to the gunsmith or scavenge supplies by the clock shop? Why torment yourself, I ask? The ox cannot become a lion. And why would you want to? Who wants all those responsibilities and worry? You do your job, you eat your food, you go to sleep. Yeah, I want the carbine. Simplicity is beauty. All right. Okay, let's. <clears throat> Kid, you gotta say something if you want me to grab something. Hey, kid. <coughs> I need this job. You work for me now, buddy. For any, but thank you. Great. I've got ammo. Oh, that helps. All right. Let's go take a look around. Huh. Interesting. One day, ain't nobody noticed me. Then they think I done for Lady Comstock. Well. Everybody noticed me. I hid to fainting, and I hide. I hide deep. The more they look, deeper I go. Okay. Only thing a color child can count on is the fact they invisible. I do like the mouse of broom handle. I will say that. Good time, club. Anyone's heard that song. 
Let's go check out Chen Lin. <clears throat> I have a pressing need to speak to this so-called false shepherd, stirring up so much trouble. We got enough problems without this damn fool shooting up the city and blaming it all on the fox. Though if he's amiable, yeah, yeah, he might be just the fellow we need for our... Ah. Oh, that's... Oh, that's sour. <clears throat> All right. of Buddhism. <coughs> 49 days under a Bodhi tree until he achieved enlightenment. Something tells me Comstock doesn't Here's cater to idols getting worse cats. than they do. Yeah, well. Hello? Hello? Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Is anybody here? What happened here? Someone worked this place over. Local constabulary yeah. moved out. Someone downstairs. Excuse me. Man, I'm sorry to bother you. I... We're looking for Mr. Lin. Mr. Chen Lin. Booker. Mr. Lin, not here. He gone. Gone? They take flying squad. I pray, Gautama Buddha. Pray, give husband back. Give back to Meilin. Where did they take him? Club. Everyone take to good time club. Where is this club? <laughs> Ma'am, please, where, where is this club? We already know it is. Find it. Just leave her be. Why not Vox Bully help Chen Lin? Why not Daisy Fitzroy help Chen Lin? <laughs> Who is this? Cops. The kind who probably got their boot on Lin's throat and told him how well he knows Daisy Fitzroy. Isn't she the one we're working for? As a matter of fact, it is. Right, let's figure out where this good time club is. I already is. know where it is. But. <clears throat> Strange. Booker, grab that lockpick. Come on, reload. Thank you. Uh, no, no, not right now. Oh, thank God. I made my lungs seize up. I panic. Sure, I panic. I'm sorry about what I said at the docks. Calling a thug. I am a thug. Can't see how I might have changed your sense of that. You protect. There it is, Mr. Dewitt. Now we just need to head inside and find Mr. Lin, and just call me Booker. 
Just call me Booker. We need to move. I'm a hand cam. This young gold getter is a former devotee of Lady Comstock. But without the old gal, they don't know quite what to do with themselves. Pick this one up at a hiring fair for a song. Get stuff. I need move.
Tax booker. Much obliged. Good show. All right. Get it up. Come on. interested in your job, Fink. Now, now, I know all about your little job for Fitzroy. But do you really want to take her offer over mine? Do you know how many people would kill to be head of Fink's security? <laughs> You're a Kick tough up. nut to crack, Mr. DeWitt. A tough nut. <laughs> but <laughs> I promise you this. I will get what I want. Okay, okay. <laughs> Booker, there's a door over here. I think that's the way down. Okay. Let's get that. I had thought you a fool, dear brother. When you told me that you heard wonderful music trumpeting from holes in the thin air, I began to doubt your mental integrity. But not only have you made your fortune from these two dads, you have lit the path for me as well. On there. Okay, what up? Hello. Yes, please. <coughs> Like <clears throat> really? Yeah, I was with the Pinkertons. They call us in when the workers got restless. To do what? Demonstrate the folly of men striking, throwing down tools. <gasps> I'll tell you this. Sometimes there's precious need for folks like Fitzroy. Why? Because of folks like me. There. Yep. Get over here! Okay. Hey, a code book. Any idea what it deciphers? No. Let's keep an eye out. Hello. Tell us what you know about Fitzroy, you goddamn gook. You know you can okay. Hear. You want to say something? Or you want us to bring in Mrs. Lynn for company? Oh, what's that smell? Yeah, you know privies down here. That not cruel? To forbid the mixing of the races. Is that not cruel? What have people done to deserve to be locked up in a place like this? I think they'll need much of a reason. No. No, he doesn't. But is it not cruel to banish your children from a perfect garden? Or drown your flock okay. under an ocean of water? Cruelty can be instructive. What is Columbia, <sighs> if not the schoolhouse of the Lord? This is it, isn't it? Yep, number nine. It's done. Can you get this open? Come on, give me something challenging. All done. What have on right now? 
I'll take the damage against Handyman. See how quickly I killed him. Do it? You're a lion. But you can't blame me for looking after my own interests, can you? Anyways, thank you everyone for watching. I will see you all next time. As always, I've been Mr. Fulcrum, you touched the most. And no matter where you go, there you are. As long as you're having fun, you can leave sadness behind. See you next time.